Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the Band, Band Pickers. Pickers. How are you guys doing today? Good, good. Good, good, good. Fantastic, actually, right? Fantastic. Yes. Sold Sunday. Yes, sold Sunday. And man, did we sell some stuff. We sold so much stuff this weekend. We're so thankful to have such a great weekend. Um, so it kind of started off a little bit slow, right? I mean, I it seemed so. like it, like on Friday, really. And then I'm like, I'm going to send out offer to watchers, you know, on eBay where you can do that. Um, and they've made it a lot easier. So you can just click the thing. Yes. So I think I sent out like 220 offers or something like that on stuff. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we sold quite a bit. Yeah. So not all of this is that, but a few of them, quite a few. Yeah. Are, some of them are, are the offer, anyway. like, yeah. I don't know, like maybe 15 things Yeah. Um, out of everything we sold. So that was great yeah. that uh, we sold some stuff that way. Right? Yeah. <clears throat> Anytime you sell stuff, it's great, right? Yeah. I mean, we were super excited. Like, we had two awesome, awesome days in a row. Yeah. So that was exciting for us, especially we didn't set out auctions this weekend. So we're like, uh, who knows what we're going to yeah, sell this you, weekend. You never know. And then God provided some sales for us. Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. so. Yeah, so we did our <clears throat> premiere. Is that what it was called? Yeah, where it was like a recorded video and then yeah. we were chatting. Right. So that was really fun. Thank you to everybody that was in the yeah. chat. And, and especially to Angie because... What would I do without her? <laughs> it would have been... so on top of it. It would have been awful without her right like i couldn't keep up with the chat like, there's a you know it'll come up and then you start to read it and then phew, it's gone because there's like five <laughs> others and it's like wait i wasn't done reading it was like so fast it was but angie she said she's on her treadmill and stuff while she's watching and doing all and the she's stuff. saying hi to everyone it was like she was amazing i mean amazing yeah. so thank you angie yes, that's thank dizzy you so angie much for that. um it, she's over on youtube yeah. She does haul videos. She also does like unboxing videos. She does giveaways. She does all kinds of awesome stuff. Yeah. I will link her channel down below. Thank you so much. I really Thank appreciate you. her. Okay. And then also in the video, I had this shirt with a woman without a top on that I showed. And I offended some people who were pretty upset with me for showing that. So those kind of shirts for us... I see them. I pick them up. They sell pretty good. I don't have to put them in the video, though. If it's going to offend people, I I don't have to put them in the videos anymore. I'm sorry I offended people. Um, those things sell. It's an outside-the-box kind of thing. Some people won't sell it, won't get it. Some people won't sell things with beer names and stuff like that. Um, we do, and there you go. So... Sorry that I offended people. Thank you for apologizing. Sure. <laughs> I still am going to get them, though. I know. I just don't have to show them. Well, it, that's why he also did I've say, I've sold like, some of them for hundreds of dollars in the past. He gave, like, a warning, but, like, I don't, you know. Yeah, so anyway. And then Street Savvy commented, just close your eyes list really fast. So that's what I did. Really quick. There yeah. you go. It's on. <laughs> All right. Hopefully it'll sell. What are you going to do when it's in Sold Sunday next week? I just won't show it, I guess. Sounds like a plan. I'll show the back of it. Just there you go. So, there you go. Okay. Okay. Uh, Let's get into this. It's gonna take us have? a long, okay. long time. Okay. So, uh, Van, um, he paid for his item. It's not gonna be in here because because we had it, we last, had it last week. week. But he did pay for it. So thank yeah. you, Van, on the North Face so um, you, big yeah. fanny pack thing. <clears throat> right. So we'll get that shipped out Tuesday because tomorrow is a holiday. So we didn't ship out. Like I probably should have shipped out on Saturday, but I didn't. So. No mail tomorrow. I have one more confession before we start. That's not the only bad thing I've done. I went to the bin three times. I know I'm only supposed to go once, and I went three times, too. So. I think you went four. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe I went four times. Yeah, because then we, we went the day we were supposed to go, and then we went back one night just for the end rotation. Right. And then we went racks to resell hope. She actually sent me a thing or she posted on Instagram, you know, bin pickers, where are you? It's so good. So then we went. And of course, I think we went after it was good because <laughs> she got a bunch of stuff. She actually put a haul video up. She got 81 pounds of stuff. Yeah. She was there like seven hours or something at the bin. Oh, wow. So then we had to go because we had to go check it out. And that's when we were doing the premiere video. Right. So, we, so were like, we could only stay for right. A short time. We only stayed for 
I don't even know, like one switch out or something. Yeah. So, so I was I was doing so good. And then you went again um, not, after that. <laughs> it wasn't. I'm very so good. embarrassed. No, you're not. Maybe I should go to make up for it. <laughs> Jeez. So, anyways, um, yeah, I'm just a bad boy. <laughs> uh, Your once a week just doesn't cut it, right? Yeah, once a week. Just not enough for me, I guess. I guess not. Okay, are you getting into this yeah. now, or? Yes. Vintage Tommy Hilfiger, like, puffer, down, jacket. This has, like, the bigger logo, like, on the back of the neck on the top. This was a little bit stretched big. out on the, well, it's not a big. Yeah, on the cost. like so we the put elastic that. was stretched out on that. But it's still, like, a big, fluffy, warm jacket, yeah. I value. $30 on that. And now it's gone. Goodbye. Vintage Polo Ralph Lauren. This is a boy's, unfortunately. She it was says that, but it, it is has huge. the kids tag though. It's it's green. This green tag is kids, like a vintage kids tag. I'm just telling you, it's extra large. I'm just There's no way you. it's a men's extra large. It's way too big for me. Well, it's a boy's tag. It's twenty twenty bucks. We sold okay. it for twenty bucks. We can't talk about every single thing. We can't. <laughs> Let's talk about this. Okay, Abercrombie and Fitch. I'd love to find these. But you're talking about it. I'm just telling oh. you, these camo distressed shorts, awesomeness, sixty three seventy four. I 63 love that. Sixty three seventy four. Not too bad. Here's another one of these vintage shirts. When I got that whole big stack, yeah. I sold a few. I still have sold a, quite few a few on. Fifteen bucks on this. Um, so it this was coming is coming out. out down here. Yeah. So, so I took an offer of fifteen. Cool, easy rider pants. Cool pants. Um, vintage patina dye or whatever, twenty six bucks. What do we have here? It's our oh, this first is that. This hundred is that dollar sale. We've had this for a while. It stinks. It it just smells like somebody stored it in their garage or something. And I listed yeah. that, and it has like some marks and stuff. It's really cool. It's like sixties vintage racing jacket. Right. Um, it's called Lancer Leathers. This says Creed on the back. I don't know. Hundred bucks. Somebody oh. offered a hundred dollars. I'm like, yep, I'll take that. Okay. We actually have a few hundred dollar items, like sale items this weekend, which is really good. Well, for Well, these us. you just got these Red Wing boots. I did. And you almost got a hundred for these. Well, I got ninety for them. That's almost a hundred. I right? put them on for ninety, and somebody bought them. They didn't even offer. They just and it's them. international shipping, so they paid a lot of money shipping because so they're so heavy. I know, right? So some of those vintage Red Wings are good. Some of them aren't. But those look decent like that. I probably could have put on a little bit higher, but whatever. 90 bucks. I'll got take 90 it. bucks and they're gone. You just got them. So. You just got these. I think the same day, wasn't it? Patagonia baggies. 40 bucks for these. I, I love, love these. these. <laughs> I know. They're not that heavy. I love them. I sold a pair of plain ones for 50 bucks recently, too. The khaki too. plain ones, yeah. yeah, are pretty good. We got Joe's jeans. 15 bucks. This was offered a watcher. Actually, a couple of well, those easy, cool rider, cool pants were also offered a watcher. Okay. So Joe's jeans, 15 bucks. Sorry. This also was one. Vintage Columbia vest. It's kind of reversible. Or it's not kind of. It is reversible. It has this cool fleecy print here. Yeah. And then. So if you don't see the tag, you know, it, it's usually in a pocket. It is in the pocket. So if Men's you large. see something reversible, check the pockets. Uh, okay. 20 bucks on that vest. These Patagonia shorts, not as exciting as the baggies because they're just regular shorts, cargo shorts. 13 bucks on those. And we've had these for a really long time. Haven't been able to sell them. So. And now we sold them 13 bucks. Uh, vintage, <clears throat> this is like California brand. Another one of these vintage shirts. Yep. It's kind of like paisley print, funkiness. 25 bucks. Okay. And that like weighs nothing. It weighs something. No, I know. Okay, now where are we going here? It's over here. Well, okay. I, I was downstairs taking pictures of bras or something because we sent out bras out to auction this weekend. Oh, right. I was working on that and my phone's like, ching, ching, <laughs> ching, ching. I'm like, we have auctions ending? I'm like, we don't even have auctions. It was so fun while I was sending out the offer to watchers. I'm like, what is going and on? And people were just like taking the offers. I was like... This is so exciting. It was so fun. It was like really fun. So anyway. But we've worked hard the last couple of weeks. So 
that also is a lot of why it wasn't because we didn't work hard. You know what I mean? We've worked hard to, yeah, we to have get worked this, hard. right? Definitely. This coach bag, I listed it, and then there were watchers, so I sent offer to watchers 20 bucks, sold it. And then there was a few things I sent offer to watchers, and then other people came in and bought them for what they were on for, didn't even offer, like this. Cuddle Duds, girls, it was on sale, twelve seventy four. So I had sent an offer, but then somebody else bought it hmm. for the price it was on. These were offered to watcher too. Pill Crow in the letter press, which is anthropology. Um, <clears throat> they are really cute. Look how they have a little bit of wear on the hem, but like I like the big wideness. Ten bucks on that. That was you offer. Like the big wideness. The wide leg, but like when you're short like me, if you wear wide leg, it just makes you look shorter. Seems like, doesn't it? Um, I just look short no matter what. Okay, this is the Islander bathing suit. Candace got this. Thank you, Candace. This was also offered a watcher nine bucks. So, Candace, thank you for buying that. This is a cute bathing suit. It is it? very I, cute. I think it's cute. And I like it. All... It is cute. So, thank you, Candace. Yes, thank you. Girls North Face. I took an offer on this. It didn't have a size tag, so I measured it um, Guess and I the guesstimated size. the size, but said make sure you check the measurements. Fourteen fifteen. And I do list measurements on clothing just because I feel like if I don't, I mean, I could list a lot faster if I didn't measure, but then I would feel like people are going to get it and not, you don't have anything to back you up. Like if they say, oh, this doesn't fit. Right. You got, you can't say, well, I listed measurements. I don't know. Spider jacket. Like somebody bought this too. They didn't even offer. They just bought it 37 bucks. Okay. It's a nice, it's one of those like knit core ones or whatever they're called. Uh-huh. <clears throat> Ugg boots. These are cute because they're not like traditional looking Uggs. That's what we're working on Uggs and we didn't sell a lot of Uggs. We have a few in here or we sold, yeah, we, we, we've only we sold, sold a handful. We but... sold some, but we haven't sold a lot. Well, I did we price sold them. a ton of jackets. I priced them a little higher just so I could make sure I could put them on sale or accept a lower offer. You know what I mean? Because yeah. I wanted to make sure. We're not done with the Uggs though and the other boots. They're still, no, so many. still a long ways to go. Ugg boots, 32 bucks on those Uggs. You just got this. And then somebody offered $21. And I, I haven't it. seen one of these for quite a long time. This one's pretty nice. It's an Enel bra. So I was looking up Enel. Wait, how much did you sell for? 21 bucks. 21 bucks. And they, it's light. They make so. a size 8. Mm. Have you seen a size no. 8? Somebody had a size 8 on, which is pretty big. I mean, <coughs> I would think it'd be pretty big bra. I've seen a... Um, 6, I think, is the biggest we had. Why? 6? I was thinking 4. No, well, I think we had a 6 one time, but I'm not sure. So these are Bond Trager like um, leggings. Wait, this is what we sold too. I forgot to say, we sold this from Friday afternoon to Sunday morning, basically around noon. Because yeah. we didn't actually sell just the weekend. This People all the time say, "Is that what you sold all week?" That's what we sold Friday afternoon to Sunday around noon. Yeah, so like over the weekend. Just over the weekend, not what we sold all week. That stuff we've already printed. Sent out everything that we sold during the week. Right. So these are Bond Trager. Kathleen got these. She got these and the next Ugg boots. So these, six bucks. That was an offer to watch her. So thank you, Kathleen, for taking that. And these Ugg boots. Super cute. 28 bucks on those. See, we had another pair of Uggs. These are so cute. The pink quilted short. Adorable. Yeah. So Kathleen, thank you. Okay. Those are going to look adorable. <laughs> okay, so North Face... Um, I took off on this 15 because it does have two holes. It's like a 550 down. I think it had three little holes in it. It has some holes, yeah. Which you could like. But I still got it. I mean, they're really. I mean, expensive. 15 bucks. It's not that heavy. Yeah. Um, 15 bucks on that. Sorry, I'm getting sidetracked. Plus shipping too on this stuff. Plus we, shipping. We charge shipping. Right. Well, except on these ones for Kathleen, I don't know what happened on that. But I think she got free shipping on that. So I'm glad it's somebody that watches us. Because I don't know if I clicked something wrong or what I did. So anyway. So yeah, I was like, so okay, phew. At least it's somebody that, uh, you know, watches. And um, so thanks, Kathleen. <laughs> anyway. Well, everyone so, else paid shipping. Everyone else paid shipping. Free people dress. We've had this for quite a while. It's a cute little Bavarian looking dress. Eleven fifty four on it that. It looks like dress. an Oktoberfest dress or whatever. It's very cute. It's like you could work at Matterhorn, Disneyland. <laughs> this too. Isn't this funny? Because this is kind of like the 
you know, whatever, whatever it is, Astrifa or whatever. It's like German, um, whatever, Austrian sweater. 30 bucks on that. We don't know, but sold it. Sold it. We usually sell those kind of things when we pick them up. Then we got these Birkenstocks. We just had these too. Um, $25 plus shipping on those. Those are cute. I know Stacy was looking at those, but she wanted black. So I said, I got to keep my eye out for black on those. Wait, I got to figure out where I'm at now. Oh, no. Celeste. Okay, I'm right here. I got it. Okay, so this was actually the first thing I sold when I was sending out things. Mm -hmm. And Jamie actually bought this. She came in and bought it and said, thank you so much for sending the offer. So I was glad yeah. that... I was super excited that it was so somebody what, that was. So what is it exactly? It's, it's like a, a poncho. Poncho. I think you got it upside oh, down. Oh, I see. It goes like So, this. and that was $15. It was so, hang like this. Yeah. Thank you, Jamie. Or something. So one arm doesn't come out? I'm, I'm not sure. It's like a poncho. You like put it over you? She'll figure it out. So thank you, Jamie, on that one. Yes, thank you. We've had this for like ever, Brooks Brother. <clears throat> this was another thing. Like I sent offer to watchers, but somebody came in and bought it for fifteen twenty nine. Okay. So I wonder if you sent out offer to watchers, if somebody goes in and looks at the listing, does it say that there's other offers on it? Do you know what I'm saying? Maybe it does. So, I mean, because I sold like three or four things. I, I don't know how it works. Who knows? Ariat vest, 13 bucks. That's another offer to watcher. Here's another one. J. Crew vest, 17 bucks. Offer to watcher. Peruvian connection sweater, offer to watcher, 30 bucks. I think I have one left of those because then I get like five. Is there only one left? I think so. So this belt, like when we got it, which wasn't that long ago, it looks really distressed. But, but you just put it on. I did just put it on like this past, the last it few days. It says jazz. And it's called Island Leathers by Bill Lavin or something like that. Leather so, Island. I don't know. Can you think you can show that? Because if you see a belt like, like Bill? this, like if you just look this at the belt, part? it looks really distressed. Okay, I'll show that. But that brand of belt is actually does pretty well. So if you happen mm -hmm. to see belts like that, I just thought it was cool because it was embroidered right. jazz. It had these musicians on it, people dancing around. I thought it was really cool looking. And some belts are really good, and some aren't. I mean, I mean, this sold for $40. Yeah, for sold this for 40 bucks. I'll take it, right? But we but, knew it was good when we got it. You know, it. those Choco belts, I don't know if I got them at the same time, but I listed at the same time. I was more excited about those new Choco belts I got. Yeah. But this is way better. I mean, I didn't sell one of those. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> I sold that for 40 bucks. You have to sell two of those at full price to... I know. Them. Mountain hoodies. I think I only have one of these left. So the mountain, 28 bucks on this one. It's cool. Yeah. Plus it has the wolves <clears throat> and the feathers and stuff on it. Um, Crocs. Elizabeth got these. Thank you, Elizabeth. Oh, Elizabeth bought yep. these. Yep. 16 bucks on these. So I'll be excited to see if she's going to wear them. She's going to give them somebody. Because <laughs> she bought jeans the, this past these week. These are pretty cute Crocs, They're huh? super cute. She bought some jeans. She said, oh, her new school jeans. She's super excited. She's a teacher. So, and I got to say. Wait, she's a teacher? Yeah. An yeah, art teacher. So, I guess I didn't know that. Really quick. She's actually... The first time I sent out offers to watchers, this is months ago when they first came out with it. A long time ago. A long right. time ago. She's actually the first bought, like person that bought when an I offer sent to like an her. offer she to like her first. from us. Oh. So yeah. I, I, you know, like, ah, oh, special. <laughs> right? Uh, yeah. So it was kind of cool. Anyway, so it's thank you, Elizabeth. It's funny to remember all that kind of stuff. Well, thank you, Elizabeth, for getting those Crocs. I hope you love them. Bears jersey, 15 bucks. It all, like, you know, people that watch us and then they buy something, it, like, almost, it, you know, because, like, I got to re I got to register the kids for school this week, um, you know, so, like, the stuff we sold this weekend, it's almost like, I, and I have to register them for school, which costs money, right? So, for, like, the homeschool that we go through. Mm -hmm. So, it's like, the stuff we sold this weekend is actually going to pay to register the kids for school. I mean, my parents probably give me some money, too, but... <laughs> You know, so it's really cool. So people that bought stuff this weekend, everybody that bought stuff this weekend is helping um, educate my children. Yeah, well, so that's pretty cool, that. right? Yeah. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. Okay, so we have this new tag, Falls Creek. It has unicorn print. It's just from Meyer, right? Like, but new tag. Where's the tag? But well, it's it water is. resistant. It is water resistant, but and unicorns. I mean, who doesn't love unicorns? Wouldn't get it because it just 
you know, it's just says $35, which they probably paid more than that with shipping to get it to them, but it's super cute. Because $25 on that one. $25. That was another thing. I sent off for watchers, and somebody came in and bought it. Hmm. No offer, <clears throat> we just bought it. But look at all these jackets. Our jacket pile that you put on it's is like going down. Beautiful, right? Isn't it awesome? Because we had hundreds of jackets. So many jackets. And as you can see, here's we're another jacket. Them. Kelsey got this one, nineteen dollars for this Marmont jacket. Thank you, Kelsey. That's a nice jacket. There is quite a bit of jackets in here. Isn't so there? actually, this is something that Story I just time. picked up, and I didn't know what it was. Indianapolis ice. I didn't really know. It seemed really cool, and it was kind of outside the box. No one else got it. You know what I mean? It had a name on it. And I really I wasn't know. sure what all these names were. Right. And I still have no idea what the jersey is. We couldn't find anything on it. But like Hope's husband had said, like she commented and said that they're like a farm team or something from Chicago Blackhawks or something. Right. But Which now they're not this anymore, I think, or something. Right, because they're Indiana something else. I don't know. So like in 2004. They I couldn't find this jersey anywhere. I'm like, maybe it's no good. I got it. I'm like, put it on for 100 bucks. And we'll see what happens. And someone bought it right away. So, hundred bucks. It must have been pretty decent, at least. I guess. I mean, it has the like fight strap in it and stuff. So, yeah. I'm not sure if it was one they wore or what, but hundred dollars. Yeah. And it might have been worth more than a hundred dollars, but I'll take a hundred bucks. Couldn't find anything on it. Now I gotta see where you're at again. Not like that. So much stuff. More jackets. More jackets. Marissa this got this. This is a really cool jacket. I know. It's super cute. It's down, right? It's North Face down. It's like the Brooklyn style or whatever with this furry. I mean, this is cute. Come this on. This is a nice jacket. Yeah. And I had it on for $100 and I sent an offer to Watcher, $75. And she took it. So thank you so much. <laughs> Wait, who was it? Marisa. Is Marissa. it Marissa or Marissa? I'm not exactly sure because it has a U in here. So I, I, if I'm saying it wrong, I apologize. Okay. But we do appreciate. Yeah. And I hope you love your new jacket because it is cute. I would love to wear a jacket like that. Yeah. You know Long what I mean? jacket like that. And then you have like boots on or whatever. Well, it's real cold. And really cute. jacket that goes down to your knees is pretty nice. Right. right? So we got this cool hoodie here. Cool 16 hoodie. bucks. It's just like a lightweight hoodie jacket thing. Mm -hmm. New tag Nike, um, but it says like Remax, Remax Realtors Ability Plus. I'm not sure. Uh, $8.49 on that shirt. Okay. I don't normally get these, even if they're new tag Nike, that say stuff. But this said Remax. I'm like, you know, maybe someone that works at Remax. Would want it. Maybe, you know. But I see tons of them. But we haven't got them. Things. Like, we've seen quite a few the last but few Remax months. But Remax is kind of a big thing. It is, and but it's we've like had maybe that for someone a while, too. But we eventually sold it, but how much? Eight forty nine. Yeah, so not for a lot. But you know that adds up. Shock absorber bra, five bucks. I mean, plus shipping. I mean, they they're paying like thirteen bucks for it. But we actually have passed up. We've seen quite a few of those with stuff New on Italian, it. Men's yeah. too. We're just not getting them anymore. Victoria's Secret nightgown. But if they don't say anything, I get them. Well, absolutely. If it doesn't say anything. But if it has an embroidery on it, we're not getting it for the most part. Right. Unless it says something that could appeal to a lot of people like Remax. Correct. There's, I'm sure there's a lot of people at work. But usually Remax. it's like plumbers or something. You know, right. like it says some plumbing company or something like well, that. Well, if it just so. says plumbers, there's a lot of plumbers out okay, there. Okay, well, right? if it just said that, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. This is super long. Victoria's silk. Secret nightgown. And it's so pretty. It's like sheer here. It's so silky. Uh -huh. uh, 16 bucks. Do you like silky shirts? I like silky nightgowns. You do? <laughs> I've never seen you wear a nightgown like that. Come on. TMI or? <laughs> cotton. you got to sleep in cotton. Otherwise, sweating to death. This is coach. It is coach. And I just put it on. And then there was a bunch of watchers, so I sent an offer to watcher, 125 bucks, and somebody took that. I'll take 125 bucks. There you go. Especially somebody threw that back at the bin. So that's the third hundred dollar item that we sold. You guys, like, we're so thankful, grateful. You know what I mean? Such a, like, yeah. And we also put in a lot of work. We did put in a lot. You gotta of mention work. that. I mean, we did put in a lot of work. Right. Um, and we actually got some good items, obviously. 
<laughs> Vintage Junie wallet. I just put this Wait, on, Wait, so too. I should probably go to Ben more is what you're saying. Well, you see, when you go to the Ben more, you get more $100 items. Right? Absolutely. I mean, the more you $100 go, I mean, items. If you go every day, you're going to get, you know, if you're there. Some people go there literally for almost every switch out. But all these $100 items that we sold, they're from the last two weeks that right. we've been to the bin. Now I've lost my spot. Sorry. Vintage Juni wallet, 23 bucks. We just got that too. Well, we're going to have to stop pretty soon because uh, my pile's over. And we'll move some stuff. Okay, new tag Sweaty Betty, 40 bucks. Sweaty Betty. And that's the first time we ever found that brand. And now it's gone. For nursing bras, I think there's like... Motherhood, Candleu, yeah, it's or kind Candleu, of a, however you say it. It's kind of a mix, but all the same size. Yeah. But there's four of them. Yeah, uh, fifteen bucks on those. Sold them pretty cheap. Some new mama will be happy to have those though. North Face Osito Super Soft Silky Fleece, twenty three bucks. And it's orange. Let's yeah, is this orange. the one? I think it had a little, it had a little mark in the pocket or something. Maybe mark. not. No, maybe I'm thinking of something else. Hmm. I put on so many of those jackets. <laughs> okay, what are we on? We moved some stuff, so now we have a little I more room. I got a little more room here. Okay, so this is Banana Republic Alpaca Wool Blanket. We've actually had it for quite a while. Sent an offer to watch her. Oh, it's really cool. 25 bucks. Somebody took it. Love it. Sunstreak Newport News bathing suit offer watcher 10 bucks. It is more fun to sell stuff than to not, right? Well, absolutely, it is. Well, it was so fun sending the offers too, and then people were buying stuff. And it was like, and then I feel like eBay was like, oh, they have some activity going on, we better turn on their store. And then it was like, we were selling other stuff. It was just like so exciting the last two days. I don't know, I just felt. I hope everyone else is having, like, great weekends like that, which I think they are. I mean, looking on Instagram, it looks like things are kind of, you know, going for people <coughs> also. So. Yeah. Okay. New Attack Apartment 9 Cashmere Sweater, 16 bucks. Offer to Watcher. Liker, Watcher. I forget what it's called. Boston Proper. This is super cute. It's all embroidered. This, again, 10 bucks. Offer to Watcher. I don't pick that up anymore. I don't either. But I mean that we got ten bucks for that, and what do we pay? Fifty cents? I mean, that's pretty good. We've sold this once before and it was returned. And uh, now I sold it again. 35 bucks. New attack Vicky Vi dress. I think it's a plus size. It is a good fall color. Size two X. Yeah. Hundred and eight dollars. And I sold it for thirty five. Not too bad. Okay. EQ breeches. Um, these are like a really thick and I did say, like, this is coming off down here, but they're like a really they're thick like fleece, fleece line. on the inside. Um, they're really heavy. Perfect Should have never for, got them, but. Perfect for winter. But nine bucks on those, nine bucks. Nine for nine bucks. Okay. Now I'm trying to think. Okay, so then these few things here are going to be the price shipped. Because um, these are people actually sent me an email and were interested in some stuff that we had in videos. Okay. So Pansy got these. She got this Wild Fable super cute little cardigan thingy mm -hmm. i don't know it's adorable so she got that she got that and she got this band dress that was i think from mod clock but i'm not 100 percent sure okay um super cute it has these rings here and you can hook it up if you want to that's so cute isn't that um yeah. so she got both those things 30 dollars shipped on those so thank you pansy we really appreciate it all right Pansy. I think that's my great-grandmother's name. Pansy. Pansy. I like it. Yeah, I like floral names, don't you? Floral Obviously, names. I have a rose. <laughs> Wait, you're looking at me funny. Like floral no, names? No, I'm... You know? Uh, like Daisy, Lily, that kind of thing. I well, like, I like Lily, too. Yeah. I know. We were. If we ever had another girl, we were going to name her Lily. But then... It's not too late. No, then your cousin had a little girl and named her Lily, and so we couldn't use that anymore. She did? Yeah. Huh. She did. It's actually your cousin what? Calvin. Calvin and Jesse. Oh, right. Yeah, Lillian. Lily. Yeah, I'm right. They probably watch. So. I, I knew that. <laughs> <coughs> and, okay. And then my other cousin took our other name, Carl. Carl, yeah, for a boy. Man. Walking Dead Carl. I Carl. guess I guess we can't have any more because we don't have any names. <laughs> 
Dang. Okay, Miller hat. Robin oh, got yeah. this. Thank you so much, Robin. This cool vintage Miller High Life hat. It's old, too. I mean, it is so cool. $12 shipped on that. Wood. I mean, some of those, oh. like, you look them up, they're all over the place, but some of them sell, like, really high. Some do. Not exa we didn't see one exactly like that. Mm -hmm. I was kind of surprised. Jack got this um, Dolce and Gabbana shirt, 15 bucks. Mm -hmm. I sent him pictures of it so he can decide if it's real or not. He's going to look at it. You know, Jack Valentine, he has a channel. They do Sold Saturday. Oh, so yeah. So they have a Sold Saturday video out. What they sold, mostly on Poshmark. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, anyway. Thank you, Jack. Thanks, and then Jack. Jennifer got these. She was like, yay. <laughs> she couldn't pay right away. Like, she, she didn't see that I sent her the invoice. So she was happy she can be in Sold Sunday. So thank you, Jennifer. She actually buys quite a bit of stuff, like exercise -y stuff. There was actually some other people uh, that bought some stuff from us, but we already sent it out. I know, So right? thank you to you people. <laughs> you people, yes. Thank you so much, everybody. So many things. So... But Jennifer, on her, like, she always does the kids consignment, and I'm always like, yes, I need to do that. Like, every time she sends me an email, she's like, I'll do the kids consignment. I'm like, yeah, I need to do that. I don't know. Somebody wants to buy our kids. No, stuff. I know that so, we have Tara. She she sent me an email, so I I owe her an email because we have a bunch of kids you stuff. You owe her an email. Well, she she has me. like eighteen hundred emails that she hasn't read yet. That's how far behind an email she is. So if you send an email, <laughs> I was doing breath. so well. I'm just saying. And then I lost it. I just lost it. I don't know when I lost. Uh, like, I don't know. You get behind the day when you get that many emails and then phew, they just pile up. Fast, well, a lot of those they? are personal emails too. Or like, Rose signed me up for all this free stuff for my birthday. So now I get a bunch of those emails. And then there's, it's, ah, uh, anyway. Tabitha from Anthro. This was my Poshmark sale for the weekend. Oh, this is Poshmark? Yes. Okay. So this was really Tabitha. cute. Oh, Tabitha didn't buy it. It's called Tabitha. Yeah, it's called Tabitha. This was posh. Uh, $40. So $40. So she offered me 30 And before I could accept, because I didn't have my phone on me, since she came in and bought it for 40 bucks. So I was like, okay. score. Love that. So on that too, you know, posh, they pay the shipping, but I got to pay 20% fee on that one. So, And then Christy got this cool shirt. This is from eBay. $12. Thank you, Christy. She bought it this morning. Yeah. So. I mean, I was hoping for a hundred for it, but oh man, <coughs> I think twelve dollars sounds about right. <laughs> okay, it's it, it is cute. a cool shirt. It is a cool, cool shirt. I mean, it's like literally cool. And I just put it on too. The a lot of this stuff I just listed this week, so it's like it's exciting. To... That's probably why we didn't sell Uggs because you stopped putting Uggs on and listed some of these. Oh other right, things, that's true. Right? It's like it's always fun when you list something and then you sell it within a couple days, and it's just like in and out, and then. I love that. I know you love G -Star that. G-Star pants. These are kind of funky. I don't remember what they were called. Something funky. 26 they're called G-Star Raw. Yeah, but then there's some name. $26 on those, and they're going out of the country. That's so, all we sold. That might be the longest sold Sunday video we've had in a long time. We sold so much stuff this weekend. It's so nice. So, there. how many pounds were there? 68 pounds of stuff were sending 68 out. 68 pounds. Going off to its new home. So wonderful. So we spent eighty seven dollars and seventy two cents on. That's all our that cost because it's a dollar twenty nine a pound. We had sixty eight pounds. And everything was from the bin. I don't think there was anything from Spokane when we went. I think it's all from the bin, mostly recently. Mm -hmm. And then we sold everything for one thousand six hundred and sixty three dollars and ninety five cents. So over the weekend we sold one thousand six hundred sixty three dollars yeah. and ninety five cents. I think that's the best weekend we've had <clears throat> in a really long time. I don't think we sold that much when I sold those diapers for nine hundred and ten dollars. Yeah, I think remember? we saw like thirteen hundred dollar weekend that weekend or something. So that like wow, right? So we our return on investment is one thousand seven hundred ninety six percent. So it's almost eighteen times our money. Yeah. Um, you know, we I got to pay eBay fees and PayPal fees, but even with that, I mean, you know, I know a lot of people strive for like double their money, triple their money. I mean, to eighteen times your money almost is pretty good for us. I mean, that's why we love the bin. Right. And you never know what you're going to get. Sometimes you're going to get $100 items at the bin. <laughs> yeah, and sometimes you get a bunch of them. And then sometimes you have some great people that buy stuff. And it's like, how they people buy stuff. You know what I yeah. mean? It's like out of all the stuff on eBay, and then somebody buys something that you well, have. My Tommy, my Tommy hat, I could have sold that for $150. I had a $150 offer 
on that. Um, and that was really hard for me to decline that. I was like, yeah. <laughs> and then you sent out an offer on that for two hundred fifty bucks. Um, cause we listed it for 400, which listed it high. There's another one like it on, except not Tommy colors. So I listed mine lower, but it might just take the right buyer to come along, you know, yeah. and some stuff like that when there's not really this, you can't find that. He likes to hold out. If it was me, I would have been like, yep, I'll take it. You would have took 150. I would have, but that's me. You know, so maybe we'll sell it for 250 and then it'll be $100 more or whatever. We'll sell it for, maybe we'll end up selling for 150 bucks. I don't know. <laughs> I know well, I'm just we'll really... We'll see. Stay tuned. Yes. We'll let you know what it sells for. Yeah. We're thankful for a great weekend that we are able to work hard and give these new, new, these items new homes, right? They're all going to new homes, yeah. I know. That's for sure. So great. <clears throat> so thank you everyone for watching. And not to the trash. Right. I know, not dump. to the trash. So, and again, we don't do these videos to be like, oh, look at, you know, we sold whatever. But we do it, too, so you can see. You can we get do, stuff. We do, to say, hey, this is what we but, sold. But I'm saying, like, you can get stuff at the bin, and you can still make good, you know, a good profit on your stuff. You can still make good well, money. Especially when you sell for, the for $100. Most part. We had a really good weekend. This is not normal for us, so... <laughs> we're, we're both That's a little like excited. That's like old-day normals. I know, right? <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> but then today is kind of like, but then what happens when you have a really good day? Then it messes up your charts on your eBay, like my eBay thing. You know, I have like the graph thing. Then when you have a really good day, then it it messes up all the rest of them. It looks then the it rest looks all like look just little small. Yeah, <laughs> right. Hmm. No, but they're still great. So, thank you guys so much. Hope you guys made great sales this weekend and got some good stuff. Or got a lot of work done, right? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Anything else? Okay. Yeah. That's about it. Just pick outside the box. And, um, you know, if you don't want to sell shirts or get shirts with girls with no shirts on them, then don't, don't get them. Okay. And we won't show them. And we won't show them. Sounds but good But I will get them. And I will sell them. And I'll be annoyed by it. <laughs> you will. She likes the money, though, right? Love you, babe. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's about it. Yes. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you um, to everybody that bought anything. I'm sorry if I missed you. I tried to look to see if there were any notes on anything. So thank you guys. We'll be shipping everything out on Tuesday. Oh, yeah. Monday's the holiday. Yes. Oh, yes. And I was going to say... Everybody in Florida, be safe out there. It's I know, I'm, right? I mean, my dad's down there, and Angie's down there. And there's a, there's a lot of people. Melissa and Bear are down there. there. So She's, yeah, be careful. I'll, they're down. Be careful there. I know, right? You just never know what's going to happen. So we're keeping everyone in our prayers yeah. and hope everyone stays safe. If you need to come up north, got a place for you, <laughs> right? Yeah. But who'd want to come to Indiana? <laughs> okay. I would. Thanks, guys. Have a good weekend. Okay, God bless. Bye.